Okay, so English or Brazil? Huh, that's interesting. English or Brazilian? I'm gonna go with English this time. So, okay, still no mini sound. Hi there, here. So today we are going to play Monster Gals Dating Sim. It's a de demo? Yeah, it's it's still the demo for the game. It's first in 0405. I, I give up. Uh, this is a game developed by White Lotus Art Studio, artist Box of Tales, programmer y W L P A. I'm not sure how to say that. So yeah, let's start playing the game, shall we? It's a Monster Gal Dating Sim and still pretty. It, lo it looks interesting, but like, it it's pretty... It feels pretty empty without any sound. Alex, yes, that's the main character. What? Where am I? What even is this place? This is developed in Goddard Engine, by the way, so that's an interesting choice for a visual novel. Is that a tree smiling at me? The last thing I can remember is going into an antique store, and then, did I pass out? Well, maybe I can find someone who can help me. So many paths. Now where should I go? Art Studio Observatory. Ooh, there's only two options. There's also no indicator whether or not we are selecting stuff, which is kind of confusing at me for, for me at the main menu. Uh, by the way, why am, why am I speaking like this? It's because I have actually played the demo, the previous demo before, uh, and recorded, but they, they didn't release this version, so I was like, Okay, I'm just gonna delete the previous version. And it's still kind of the same uh, for the intro, except I think there's a few changes in the first three options, huh? I thought there was three options, again, but now there's only two. Let's see. Art Studio? Well, I'm an artist anyways. Maybe an artist will sympathize, <laughs> sympathize and help me if the studio is still open. I don't even know the time, but it's very dark already. It doesn't matter how much I know, no one answers. Did they just forget their lights on? Lizzie's art studio. Oh, Lizzie! Uh huh. I was very focused on my painting. Sorry for the delay. How can I help you? I. Oh, how late it is, is it? It's already past 20 hour? What? I should have checked close at 18. Well, you can come in anyway. Come, come. I'll show you the place. Every customer is important no matter the time. She already looked a bit strange and small, but now that she pulled me inside, does she have a tail? <laughs> you just realized now? That's funny. I don't know. Yeah, we can hide the dialog box. Oh no! <laughs> Alex, what the hell? Hey, what did you stop? Come in! Are you hyperventilating? Yes. Ooh, what are you? A lizard? Are the conspiracy theories about lizard people dominating the world out there? Why is that a concern for you? Yeah, yeah, maybe. Maybe it is true. What? Oh, wait. Are you... human? My heart must be really good if you came here all the way from the human world just to get to know me. Let's take a rest that fans go through. Oh well, you can calm down. I'll do let you take photos. Yippee! Shit, are you okay? Is all of this anxiety for getting to know me? Everything is okay. I just want to go home. Oh, you are not a fan, are you? Oh. I wonder if Eric can forget to close the portal to the human world again. Probably. Well, just calm down. Tell me, what is your name? Alex. Well, Alex, I am Lizzie. I'm a Gekka and you are the monster You are in the monster world. And you want to go back home, is that it? Yes. Yeah. Well the bad news is, I don't know how to get you home. But 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 the good news is, is that I know who can help you. Oh you you know, that's interesting. BRB, I think my fan is blowing too much into my mic. They don't not struggle, you know, you want the coldness, but at the same time you don't want you know weird random weird wind noises into the mic. Really? You wanna kill me and use my identity and skin to infiltrate the human world? Fuck! No! W what is wrong with you? Well, the other good news is that I also wanted to paint artistic nudity for you. <laughs> Can you believe that? So I see that we have a very unique opportunity here to help each other. What do you think? Artistic nudity? It means get fucking naked. Yes, you just get naked for me and I paint a portrait of your naked body. 
No, I know what artistic nudity is. I did some exercise of it in university, but I was never the one to be nude. Ah, so yeah? So you're an artist too. That only makes things easier then. Let's do this. I'll even get naked too if it makes you more comfort. What? More comfortable? No, I mean, you don't need to, but I must admit, I'm curious and kind of wish to see her. I mean, I wonder how it looks like. No. <laughs> what is you? Just stop with your mind. Your dirty mind. You were scared, remember? But will you pose for me? I don't know if... Freddy, please. Please, 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 please. How can something be so irritating and also so cute? There's a lizard girl that wants to see me naked. Yeah, just a normal day. You will really help me if I go back? Go back if I do this? Can I really go back home? Of course you will get back home. Um, you sure? I think. You think? Do you have any better idea? Hmm? Huh? She has fine. Okay, but... Get completely naked. Ask the computer box or Completely naked time! Let's do this already then. Perfect! You can get naked right there behind the folding screen if you want. Looks like she brings people here frequently. I mean, monster, I guess, not people. Wow, that's kinda discriminatory, but okay. Okay, I guess I'm ready. You are naked too! What ge what gender is this game? I'm sorry. You can sit there in that bench. Wh why are you naked? I I she's naked. What? It isn't fair for you to be the only one exposed, and I feel much more comfortable drawing like this. The less clothing, the better. Okay, she went to grip a notebook. You said you are an artist too, right? Here, for you to draw me. Let's draw each other. Uh, I don't know how I will censor this in editing, but editing, but you'll see how. Sure. How long have you been an artist, Alex? Since I remember, to be honest. Yeah, most people are like that, aren't they? But I believe it if you want. I started a bit late. At the end of my high school, I decided to try arts. Monsters go to high school. Alex, why are you so judgmental? I will blast you to oblivion. But since then, I never stopped. You said you went to university, right? I found it has to be too hard, so, so I never did go. How is it in art school? Monsters can go to university. It was cool, I guess. Well, there's a lot of things I don't really care about, but I find it interesting to have the opportunity to know a bit of everything. You, sh you sure you do? I can't imagine. It's not so cool. Can you turn your face a bit to the right? Like this? Yes. You didn't even start with your notebook yet. Don't you want to draw? I'm just a bit nervous. I forgot I had a notebook for a second. No hurry, we have the whole night. She wants to keep me here the whole night? Since I arrived, she looked like she will never stop talking with her quick voice, but... Quick voice, okay. But while she draws, it looks like she forgets the world. I can see myself in her, even if I don't talk real talk that much. Your hands are so pretty. Can you just hold the pencil away a bit longer? Yes, perfect. Somehow this little monster makes me feel comfortable in my own body than most popular and track with. It's strange. She can just shift... She can just shift quickly between notebook and me, but I didn't feel judged at all. It's really quite strange. Our font size. Okay. You're so quiet, Alex. Is everything okay? Oh, yes. How's your drawing? Do you need a specific reference? <laughs> oh, you're enjoying yourself. I am very elastic. Wow, ha, huh, I wasn't expecting that. Ha! Huh, made you laugh. I need a smile for my drawing, but offer is still up. I can do any pose you want you want. I guess I'm good for now. She's so friendly. Done! I finished my sketch, but I must admit that I want to paint a whole can fancy and since you are so pretty. But I don't want to keep you still in there for so long. Paint takes a while to dry. Oh, you already finished? Th that was fast. Indeed. Can I see yours? It's not finished yet. She's too close. She cl Is that a... No. Is that, is that a shadow or is that what I think it is? Interesting. Interesting it is. Wow, that's very good. I love your style. Just don't forget that my tail is very thick. She's from another world and don't find me strange. Even thinks I am pretty. You are pretty in your own way, buddy. Okay. It is! You are! Oh my god, hello, Alex. Thank you for not asking about... Those. It's... That's fine. I just want you to be happy, okay? Just, just be happy. 
<laughs> ba- battle scars, yeah. Uh, everyone has their battle scars. I'm a bit silly, but I never wanted to poke. But I must admit, I'm curious if you want to talk about it. Let's just say I didn't feel comfortable in my own skin before how people saw me, so I had to do something about that, something for me. And I am happy that you do something for yourself, okay? I can imagine how hard it must be. I mean, I change skin from time to time, but not because I want to. Ha ha ha. Like a lizard? I am a lizard. W- what do you mean? Huh. Well, I made a copy of my drawing, so you can take it with you. It's a gift. Indeed it is. Oh, thank you. Ah, I'm a really bad model. I didn't even wait for you to finish drawing and I started moving a lot. Huh? Want me to sit a while longer so I can finish? Oh, no need. I was already finishing. Just a bit longer and... Done. Perfect. I'm going to scan your suit. You can get dressed already. I'll be back and then I can take you to Erika. She will get you home. Who's Erika? The one that will help you get back home. I think I made it clear. Oh. She's a demon, if that's what you're worried about. I must admit that this information makes me very worried. Okay, are you ready to go? Yes. She told me that uh, this Erika is a bit hard to deal with. Let's see what I get myself into. Videos rental, devil, monster, vi- vi- virtual, interesting, miracle, drugs? I'm not really sure. Dog! Miracle dog, okay. Oh, maybe they actually came. Oh, what the hell? We are close. Didn't you see the sign? Oh, you're a human. Yes, it's the devil. It's literally the devil. My guest didn't tell me he was changing the delivery man. The first one was stealthier. Just come inside before anyone sees you. N- uh, no, I'm not. <laughs> she pulled me inside before I could even say anything. So, what did you bring me this time? Sorry, but I think they must have been a mistake. How do we just get here? I mean, I, I guess it's a demo, so yeah. Your boss can only be kidding. Bo- boss? Yes, when we have a new landing shop, you're here to deliver my monthly order, r- right? No. No? No. No. Then what are you doing here? Go away! And again, she threw me out so fast I couldn't even react. So, Erica, right? How do you know my name? I told your friend she told me you may be able to help me. And what is in the... Is in there for me. I have money. I could buy more DVDs from the human world with that. Okay, you can come in. <laughs> well, oh, it's that easy. Okay. And what do you need? A way to go back home. You said your your guy worked at a human addict shop, right? Yes. My last memory before waking up here was entering an antique shop. Do you think it could be related? Oh, that asshole must have forgotten the portal open. That must be it. So you know how to send me back, right? Yes, but it's, as I said before, everything has a price. As long as it is, it is in my soul. Okay, this is all I have. Five bucks? Are, are you serious? I could give you more later when I arrive at Human World. Y- yes. Now there's something extra to make up for it. Then say your soul, please say your soul. I want you to watch a movie with me. Oh, wh- what? What? My beloved friend never wanted to watch DVDs I buy from the human world me, as they are already, are already part of our of your culture. You want mine, right? Oh, uh, sure, I guess. She's much more vulnerable than she looks. I mean, she looks like a devil. <laughs> I will, I will even, even let you choose the genre. Comedy? Horror? Comedy? Horror? Comedy? Horror? Horror? Let's go with Harden. Oh, spooky! This is a zombie movie. This is more an, of an action flick than a horror movie. Ha, of course, don't you find it funny to go sounding that family is pure gold? Haha. <laughs> but if the humans don't fight back, the zombies will spread the virus. And zombies deserve to live too. So true. The zombies even live, but no human will agree to die to give place to a zombie. This is a matter of survival. Both are fighting to exist. Not all humans will just go around hitting monsters just because. Okay, but what about vampire, vampire movies? But vampires still are blood, and it's not always like that. We have many vampire romance, mostly bad quality ones. <laughs> wow. Hey, don't you dare to say that about Twilight, okay? It may have a bad quality, but it's decent in its bad quality. And what about Frankenstein monsters? What is your reasoning? Just because he didn't follow your society beauty standards. 
Okay, you do have a point. The movie exists to criticize human violence, and the stories are different, but she's already quite mad. It's better not to push. See? Humans are far worse than monsters. I really don't have the will to justify or defend it. There's a lot of shitty humans, but I bet there's a lot of shitty monsters too. Why are we st uh, 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 sh sh shush? Just shush. Yeah, there is. Yeah, I think I can see how a movie about killing a zombie is a horror movie to you. It's very sad. But maybe it is a drama movie. I don't like this movie. It was your movie choice. It was your movie choice. Was it? Let's see another one in Breaking Bad. What? What? It's just another movie. It won't kill you, but I will if you try to leave. Oh oh! It's a joke. <laughs> Somehow I didn't believe this was a joke. Oh. But really, stay, I don't want to be alone today. Monster definitely some therapy. <laughs> Any particular reason? I don't know, stop sympathizing with every monster I see, I need to focus on getting, getting back home. Hey you, I think you need a therapy. You know? I'd invited my friends to come here tonight, but none of them showed up. Oh, oh, oof. oh I'm sorry. I mean, we get to go here almost every weekend and they told me they didn't really want to come, but even then, I had hopes that I wouldn't spend the weekend alone. Maybe they just want some time for themselves? They only have the entire week for themselves. And then you come here and tell me that you had a date with one of my friends? Like, they would rather spend time with a random human than me? No offense, of course. Oh. Maybe they are just tired of- Don't say that! What the hell? <laughs> what? Calm down, express myself wrong. I mean that maybe your friends only want to do something different for once. It doesn't mean that they don't love or value you. But I never get tired of them! Did you ever try to talk to them about this? No, but I already don't know them the entire week. I keep it to myself and work the whole week, but in the weekend at least I want to see them and expect them to want to hang out with me. And then they go and post on their social every cool thing that they are doing without me. Poppy is the worst with this. Poppy, huh? I don't mean to be that, but that guy, but he seems to be a bit obsessive about your friends. What? You, th you think? It's just that they are the first groups of friends that I have that are not toxic? Oh. In a big figurative sense, of course. I am almost sure that Looney has some dusted itch or something like that. <laughs> Do we? Well, I just want to have as much fun as I can with them, even if they don't really like my movies that much. It's sure to seem like them a lot, which is nice. Yeah. And I'm sure they also like you a lot, but it feels like you don't really like yourself that much. What? No way! My self-esteem is a little high. Like, I'm hot as fuck, I'm really smart, I have amazing friends, even if I worry when they don't hang out with me, and that maybe they have more fun with me, and maybe they will never come here again. Yeah. Yeah, maybe you have a point. Yeah, Monster needs a lot of therapy. Why do you- Erica, you need to learn how to enjoy something alone and enjoy yourself. I mean, what will you do tonight if I didn't show up? Well, my assistant didn't say today. Usually he stays to watch our movies with me. Maybe I will have called my sister, or I will just go to sleep. Don't you ever take some time for yourself just to, just to think about stuff? But I don't like to be alone. I swear it's not for some demonic reason like I like having to suck life from people or something like that. I just don't like it. And I think I've spoken too much already. Why don't you talk a little bit too and stop pretending you are a shrink? What's a shrink? I just like hearing people and monster it would seem. It sounds a bit like Poppy. She's also very quiet. You will like her. I really don't like speaking that much, but I, uh, but I feel very comfortable listening to other people and being included in conversations. Don't you feel that crazy need of giving your opinion and stuff? Not really, I feel better this way. Not everyone likes to talk that much. I'm not shy or anything. When I need to speak, I speak. I just feel more comfortable being quiet. Yeah, I used to joke around in Poppy for her being this way, but I guess it's just how you guys are. Haha! <laughs> Only now I notice the movie she put. It seems like one of those silly movies. Hey, I know this movie. Did you see it already? Want me to change the movies? No, no, leave it. I like this actor. It seems like he's on every romantic comedy and he's always the same character. Yeah, it is hot. I really like his movies. They are so predictable, but they are fun. We ended up talking a lot, t talking a lot while watching movies, and I didn't see the time fly. 
Erika is much more fun than she seems. She tries to put up this tough act, but she is just insecure. How she can talk to her friends about what we talk here today? She said she would help me after a nap. I think I will do the same. Thank you for playing Nemo! Yippee! Hum 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 hum. Oh, it immediately teleports us here. Which is like interesting. Oh, oh, that causes the game. Huh. Huh. <laughs> Very interesting. So we are back here. This time we are going to pick the other options available. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Ask keep your boxers on. But I don't know if I can complete it. Maybe I can keep my boxers? If you are not comfortable, you are not comfortable. I won't make you do this. What do you think I am? A monster? Oh, what's with silence, Alex? What's with silence? Did you get my joke? Huh? Huh, okay, but to be honest, this is a bit offensive in my world. Okay, just see down, I'll get some tea. She'll leave me alone, maybe she'll run, but where to? And she doesn't look dangerous. I forgot to ask you, you want the cockroach or the cricket tea? The, the what? Uh, the, the cockroach, please. Uh huh. Okay, I also have camo chamomile. I just wanted to see your reaction, haha. <laughs> So you don't know how, you, how did you get here? I just woke up in strange town square. Well, send Erika a message. Maybe she will answer soon. Erika's the friend that can sometimes get me and some friends in the human world. Is it common for monsters to just go to human world? Kinda. Most of the monsters are happy just being here, but like some like some like to annoy the humans, and some just go just for fun. Be it personal, buy some cool stuff. And do many humans come to the monster world? Oh no, it will be a disaster. It's a good that not ma many people know about us. Oh, Erika just responded. Oh, she just sent an angry emotic. <laughs> yeah, this is supposed to be a movie week, isn't it? And she blocked me. What? I don't think she wants to talk to me today. Do you know why? Um, only if... No, she wouldn't get this mad, maybe. Mad about what? She wanted me and the girls to meet her tonight for a movie night, but I don't think anyone really want to go. Like, we do that almost every weekend. I think she may be mad about that. It's so hard to be mad about this stuff. Oh, so... So you have a lot of time to kill until she unblocks me. Isn't there a way for us to get to meet her, or...? No, there's no way. Tina tell you she's a demon. No? Yeah, so you don't want to see her mad, okay? Okay, so you said you were an artist too, right? Yes. Know what I like to do when I'm nervous? Abstract art. I never really like abstract art. It's so... Sunless? Boring? I was gonna say useless. Oof. Why? Art has the objective that, give you, that you give it. For me, abstract art is about the process, not the result. I don't know if it makes sense. I mean... So it's not useless. I guess so. And how do you want to do this? I'll get us some space in the garage. Just finish your tea and meet me there. It's gonna be fun. I have no idea what is on her mind. Let's go. Chum, my garage is my giant piece atelier. It helps that I don't have a car. Or money! I hope you don't mind. I will be on my bikini because I really don't want to mess up my shorts with pain. I brought you an apron so you don't destroy our clothes too. Yeah, I can see you change clothes. I was like, about to question that. It's okay, a lizard girl in a bikini painting a canvas with me. Never in my life I expect this to happen, so what do we do? Whatever we want. There are brushes, buckets, sponge, spray, whatever you want to use. Okay. Oh. Cute, but we will take a whole week to fill the canvas if we keep ending a small flower forever. And it's not always that you have the opportunity to just waste a lot of pain like today. Just get a bucket already. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> oh, let me try it. Okay, she's so cheerful and happy. The complete episode of myself. Oh. See? Doesn't this make you feel alive? Truly, ha, I had never done this before, and with such a big canvas. What a trash university you went then. I think you should come here more times for some particular classes with Professor Lizzie. Here, we only deal with gigantic canvas and cows every day. Ha, huh, if she invited me more times, maybe I could come. Wait, I didn't even get home yet, and I'm thinking of coming back. Grab some colors, this canvas won't feel itself. You don't need to ask twice. 
Oh. Oh. <laughs> they are all having fun, huh? That's nice. Arf, I'm starting to get tired. Haha. <laughs> Me too, but I must admit, Lizzie, I think I never had this much fun before. And it takes all the stress away, doesn't it? Tell you it was gonna be fun. You sure did. Why do I feel so close to her? So interested in spending more time with a monster? I don't know. The painting didn't turn out so good, huh? It's nice, what do you mean? Yeah. Yeah, but as I say, what matters is the process. We had a lot of fun making this. Makes sense, I guess, but I don't know. I kinda like it. Do you want to take it? I don't think I can. How? Sure, yeah, forget it, huh? In that case, I will keep it as a memory, so I can remember you. I'm gonna take a photo. Oh? 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 Yeah, 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 you do. I can see your, <laughs> your expression. Oh, sorry, I may have crossed a line. Huh? No, no, it's okay. I'll then might have even crossed even more. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, wow, what a coincidence. It's Erika, she unblocked me. Great timing. She says she may be able to help you. I can take you there if you want to. I sure have to go back at some point, I guess. But hey, you will, will always be welcome here. I hope I can visit you in the human world sometime. You sure can. Great, let's go then. Uh huh, and this is Erika part. We can try to skip this. And get to like, the choice part then. Okay, this time let's choose comedy. I guess we can watch a comedy. <laughs> this is not comedy. D it's not. Um, Erika. Uh, what? Are you sure this is the right movie? Huh, of course, don't you find it funny? The ghost hunting the family is pure gold, haha. <laughs> you know that this is a horror movie, right? If this is what she finds funny, I don't want to imagine what's horror. Of course it isn't. Are you crazy? Just You just don't get it yet. Watch a bit more. I guess this is not a good time to admit that I'm afraid of horror movies, considering what she is and all. Ah! Haha, <laughs> are you afraid? No, I'm not. Ha ha, you are! I can believe it. Do you have any idea where you are? No, I just want to get back home. Uh, poor thing, if this scares you, I ask myself what this will do. Ooh, spooky. Ah, please don't eat my soul! Ha <laughs> ha, that was good. Uh, hide your soul, I will devour it! <laughs> <laughs> okay. She's the Klaus. At this point, I don't even know anymore if I'm scared or if I am. That that was supposed to be Alex, I think. Uh, ah, uh, annoying. It's making me bored. You are making me bored. I can stop the movie if it's making you uncomfortable. She changed mood so fast. I don't know if I mind finishing the movie, but you have to understand this is scary for me. Okay, I will try not to scare you too much. It only gets scary now that I know that monsters actually exist. You didn't know? No, it's not like it's normal to know this in my world. If it makes it better, the movie industry doesn't hire monsters for, for the movies, it's all fake. Okay. Monsters have tried it before? Maybe? I was joking. Oh, haha. Uh, which part? Which part are you joking for? Uh, the, 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 does the monster actually try to apply? Is, is that part that you're joking in? Or uh, there's a monster playing movie and it's actually our real monsters, huh? Look at that, you don't know how to smile. I thought you were big. Well, you do know how to smile. I thought you would be grumpy the whole night. Well, I'm still very worried about all this. Being away from home? Yeah, that and literally being in another world. Is it normal for this to happen? No, nope, I guess the only human that showed us showed up showed how to use portal, but there must be more no humans that know about it, the monster world. Are you not afraid that it could spread the news that you guys exist? You'll only be seen as a lunatic, a conspir conspiracionist, and I could kill you very easily if you ever tried that. Uh, oh, okay, okay. 
<laughs> I mean, the conspiration is part is kind of true with the start. I'm kidding, huh? I mean, I absolutely could kill you very easily, but I'm not that kind of gal. See, the movie wasn't that bad, right? Did you survive? I'm almost, I almost didn't, huh? Huh, I can not like your sense of humor. Well, it was a good movie. The special effects were actually pretty good for a DVD era movie. Right? And when the ghost got a kid, that was awesome. I never, I never lost so much. Yeah, with that, I can agree. If it was a monster child, you wouldn't find it so funny. I will. <laughs> so true. Okay, you are just a sadist then. Ha! <laughs> it was not fun to watch a movie with you, but now I just want to know how to get back home. Can you help me? Sure about that. Uh huh. You can help me. I can, but I'll lend my magic book to my friend Poppy. So I have to go somewhere else there again then. She's probably already sleeping by now, so you know that this whole time it made me waste time watching a movie. Don't start. You had a fun. You say to yourself. Well, then I want my five bucks back. It's gone. That was the price for my rental. What the fuck? Five bucks? What kind of price is that? Ha! <laughs> well, tomorrow you can get a book and go back home. You can sleep on a beaten back today. Arr! Interesting. So there's on Yeah, there, it's hum 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 hum. It's new. So this time of reservatory. Hello <laughs> there. What is this? A moth woman? I must be dreaming. <laughs> You're just floating there. That's so silly. It's better if I go away quietly. Crack? Oh no! <laughs> the expression. <laughs> oh! You heard Lenny. Oh, you took me out of my trance. Thank you. W wh what I spoke a lot, didn't I? S sorry. Sorry. You... what are you? Huh? My name is Looney. That does not answer my question. She looks like a mouth and she's kinda cute. That is if she doesn't try to kill me. <gasps> You're a human! Yes, I am. Is that bad? You're lucky that it was me who found you. Not all the residents here are so friendly. Or I guess... It was you who found me. Okay, trying to make this worse. She definitely doesn't seem hostile, but I can trust the monster. Can I? I can believe I will ask this. Do you think you can help... Hey, what is the problem? I lost my key. Key? key? What key? The key to the observatory that my uncle let me borrow so I could look at the supermoon that is happening tonight. Do you have any idea where it could be? Why am I even trying to help a monster? I, I don't know. Let's try and retrace your steps. Maybe then you will remember. I was flying. I didn't take any steps. No, that's not what I meant. I meant to go back the way you came and see if we find it. Sniff, sniff. I was walking along that way and when I got past the tree, the, tree, the automatic lights from the outside of the observatory came on. And from there I lost my senses. Oh. Then you arrived, made all that noise and took me out of my trance. Now, now I don't know where the key is. Ah. Okay, okay, calm down. We can look for it together. Okay, so where should we even look? Next to the lamp? Next. Uh, you know what, maybe. You guys have the lamp. Next to the lamp, maybe. There's something shady in the grates. Ah, there it is. Spider. Is this a key? Ah! You found it, I'm so glad. Um, since you helped me find my key, I wanted to reward you somehow. Do you want to watch the moon with me? Um, actually I need to find a way to get back home. I can try to help you afterwards, or just really don't want to miss the windows where the moon is closest. Are you sure you don't want to stay on watch? Well, it's not like I know where I am, so I think I can stay a bit longer. Oh. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Isn't it beautiful? Paul Theater was worth staying. I must admit you were right, I've never seen the moon this way before. I wanted to be more like the moon sometimes. What do you mean? Bright and shining and brave. Yep. She just stay there, stays there being beautiful and everyone loves her. She doesn't need to do anything besides exist. You are definitely as beautiful as the moon. And she isn't there doing nothing. She has her responsibilities. I mean, she doesn't, I don't know, control the tides or something? Or turn people into werewolf or something? 
Oh, no. Oh, oh, great. So I am even more useless than Moon. I, that wasn't what I meant. Did I just come live in one, sir? All my friends already have cool jobs and some of their own business. And I'm just doing nothing all night with my head on the moon. Ah. There must be something that you are good at. What do you like to do besides watching the moon and lamps? I like reading, specifically romantic mangas. Erica is always important. Imports some from the human world for me. Okay, so I'm no longer in the human world, but right now I'm trying to help the monster. It will be a routine job hard to ask about this. Did you ever think about writing? You know, liking writing doesn't mean I will be any good at writing, but I do write some fanfics. See, it's something already. I want to know, the romance of your world, are you liking the mangas? No. Oh no, that's all made up. I thought so, haha. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I can use them as a love guide then. You, you absolutely can. You will just be focused quite a degenerate if you do so. <laughs> uh, certainly not, haha. <laughs> but why would you need a love guide? Some answers can love to. Uh, unless you're reading uh, one of those degenerate manga, which, uh, wow, do not take it. I, I was talking about, like, the romantic uh, romantic comedy sojo, something like that. That's, you know, that, uh, that, that doesn't really involve anything weird and perverted. And edgy, yeah. That, that, that you you can't copy that, and just people will view you a little bit as weird. But it's not bad. You could you could definitely romance people with that. Just don't do the typical shonen. Shonen, shonen is I don't know uh, the, uh, the one where with the weird harem um, MC. Don't do that. Don't do that at all. Uh, there's someone. Well, one of my friends that I really like. Did you ever try and say that to her? Are you crazy? Never. I like my secret romance, and I never even dated anyone. I wouldn't know where to start. How to even kiss her? You haven't even told her how you feel, and you're already thinking about a kiss? Our first kiss has to be perfect. What will I do if she doesn't like it? Lenny, have you ever kissed anyone before? Uh-huh. Hey, you don't need to be embarrassed. It's not an uncommon, unless in the human world. Um, did you ever? Ever, ever what? You kissed? Yeah, I've de dated before. How does it feel? I don't really know how to explain it's good, I think, and a bit weird. Uh, probably more on the weird side, not gonna lie. <laughs> uh-huh, yeah, sure, I, I was already predicting that it would go this direction, but okay. Can you show me how it's done? So I don't screw up. It up when I do it with her. I mean, uh, forget it. You already helped me a lot with the key. Just forget what I said. You already said from your mind. Like, uh, make, makes you explode with my mind. It's okay. I mean, I will then mine it. It's not every day you have a chance to kiss a monster. I'm curious. But what about be this being a secret romance? You change your mind fast, and don't you want uh, your first kiss to be with her? Why am I nervous? <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm addicted to romance mangas, but I'm not delusional. One day I want to approach her, and when the day comes, I want to be magical. That is if she accepts my feelings. Well, I mean, if you really want it, I can believe this. I'm really going to kiss a monster. Uh-huh. So, what do you think? Uh, I'm speechless. Wet and strange. But the thing you get used to it, right? Haha. <laughs> it is the first time I've kissed someone who isn't human. Your skin is fuzzy. Huh? But is it good? Unique. Amazing. <laughs> okay, wow. So you just move your tongue inside the mouth of the other. Oh, you look uncomfortable. Sorry for annoying you. No, no, it's really it's okay. Ha. Huh? You know, I have a hard time talking with other monsters usually, but for some reason I felt really good about opening up to you. You did look like you need to, needed to talk. I'm happy to help. I was it enough of your time. Thank you so much for helping me to see the moon today. And for the talk, and for the kiss. Let's see what I can do to help you get back home. Okay, so there, there's no options to like skip this, so I just have to turn the game off and open it again. Okay, this time next to the tree. 
Now I'll go look around the tree and look, and you look for it near the lamp. Okay, nothing here. Maybe she'll try and run when she's distracted. Uh, if you told her to go look around the lamp, I think I think she she is distracted by the lamp. Nothing in here too. Is there any other place you may have gone through? It's no use. Huh? It's no use. Everything I do, I do wrong. I can't even talk in normal this month that they already started crying and speaking all wrong. <laughs> hey, calm down. You don't need to get up so work out about this. She seems so harmless. I mean, for a month at least. Yes, I do. I'm always too clumsy, too clumsy to try and do anything that I want to do. Everything I'll try always go wrong. Goes wrong. Doesn't matter, matter what it is. I always find a way to mess things up. It seems you have a lot of things you need to talk to. I shouldn't be dumping all of this on you. I'm so sorry. If it means anything, I'm also very clumsy so much in fact that I still have no idea how did I end up here. Am I relating to this creature? I shouldn't be dumping all of this on you. I'm so sorry. Can can you tell me where am I? Oh, it's complicated. If Poppy or Erica was, were here, they will, could explain it all to you, see? I can't even do that. All my friends are so much better than me. I didn't want our heads to all these issues. <laughs> no, I just messed up something I was looking for for a long time. And even managed to lose a really important key. Well, uh, Maybe your uncle has a spare key? He has a few. I had done it many times before. Oh. But I don't want to let him know I did it again. That is, that's it. I won't be able to see the supermoon in all its majestic glory. All because I am useless, stupid, clump. For God's sake, oh, stop. Lun, isn't it? You only lost a key, and from what I can understand, it's because something you have no control about. Lun makes you lose control of your sense now. Y yeah. Why do you beat yourself up so much for something that you are not even that guilty of? Hmm. Your uncle is probably loving it at his point if he knows this always happened. He's already expecting it. That's second great monsters. What? what? But that is not all that I get wrong, you know? I'm bad at everything. I actually think you are pretty strong. You know things could go the, all this way and you still still you tried. That is true. But I would still like to be able to get take a closer look at the moon tonight. I could try and take some photos with my camera, it's pretty good quality. Oh, that sounds nice. <laughs> okay. We ended up having a lot of fun while taking the photos of the moon. I saw my specimen and I still have no idea how to get back home. I wish I could send you the photos with the nine. Oh, you can just send them to my phone. You... You have a phone? I do. It is nowadays. But you are... I mean, why didn't you say anything until now? I was teaching you how to use the camera for nothing. Did you? I don't need the key to stop you. I had a lot of fun today. Your children just makes me very nervous, but you are a very nice human. I was comfortable by your side. I'll see if I can get you in contact with one of my friends so they can help you get home. Okay, and we get to Erika part again. Okay, so we finished the demo and let me get into my review straight away. Uh, okay, the art the art is cool. And also, actually, I actually love the individual storyline that they give to each monster. Uh, Lizzie, Lizzie is actually very emotional to me and very interesting as well. I love that they are not afraid to use artistic beauty in the, in the, in the game. Even though, uh, did they put it in the content warning? <laughs> they should have put it. It was uh, kind of shocking to me when I was recording and was like, what are you doing? <laughs> but it is emotional and I love it. It's just perfect. Uh, where was I? Yeah, in individual storyline is perfect. However, uh, when you try to connect both the storyline with Erika, like either Lizzie or Looney with Erika, it's it gets a little bit bizarre. Like, hey, I don't really feel the connection between the two storyline. Like, when we're getting here, it just feels kind of weird. And then the other thing that I need to note is that uh, this one is a ma major flaw of the game, obviously. Uh, wait. I love the art style. I I think I already said that the background is really detailed. That's insane, and all the character just looks nice. And let's get to the flow, shall we? Uh, the first one, a major flaw in my opinion, is that this is developed in Godot Engine, which is I don't know if Godot Engine has the capability to do so or not. Which 
As far as I play this game, there's no skip options, unlike Renpai games, which have skip options, obviously. There is no... Honestly, I think that's all for Renpai, the mixed Renpai, which there, because Renpai has a quick save option, that's one. Renpai has a skip option, that's two. Renpai also have a rollback option, usually. That is three, unless like disabled. Uh, those three usually exist in a rent by game unless disabled, and they make uh, playing visual novel so much more uh, easier, which is great. Which does, doesn't exist at all in this game. Like, I mean, if it's disabled, sure, I guess. But like, considering the way it's designed, skip skip thing is a really skip button is a really skip function is a really necessary thing to be added. Uh, what else? Uh, the main menu doesn't function, I, I think, unless I'm wrong. But there's no options to like open the main menu and just go back to the title screen, which is combined with the skip, a non-existent skip thing, it makes it a little bit frustrating just to click, 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 click to go back to the road that you want to explore and check. And finally, uh, what else? The the sound of <laughs> it, it's very silent. This game is very silent. I don't know why the demo is very silent. I, I feel like adding some background music will already do so much more, a lot, to the game. The silence just makes it feel very... I don't know, I, I think I already said it back then at the start of the game. It feels very empty, you could say that. And it's just hard to like talk sometimes when it's very empty, but other than that, I don't have any more criticism for the game. It's it's good. Like I, I I would love to see it in the future with more improvement, obviously, to the story connections, the individual stories are the strong, like I said, and to the quality of life and of course the song music design. But other than that, that's all. So I guess that's all for Master Gulls 0.5 demo. I hope you enjoy it. See you later then in the full release of the game, maybe, or in the next demo, or in my next video. Bye bye. Oh,